So one of the most confusing things about edge annuity are the multiple grades that you see. So I wanted to just take a quick minute and explain the three different grades. So for any class, it'll tell you your actual grade here, but to see all of them, if you go into the class and then you go over here to the little graph, it gives you all of the information about each course. So there are three grades. There's the actual grade, the overall grade, and the relative grade. The overall grade is the grade that is based on all of the work that you've completed. So it takes um, the tests, the quizzes, the assignments, and the essays that you might have, all of those, it takes those, it takes how well you did, and it tells you how you're doing in the course based on the work that you've already done. The relative grade is takes all of that into account, and then it assumes what you would get if you stopped working at that point in the course. So it takes the work you've done, and then it assumes if you do nothing else for the rest of the course and you get zeros on all of the unfinished assignments, it calculates what the grade would be. And the actual grade basically just um, penalizes, doesn't assume zeros for the work that's not done, it just penalizes you if you're behind. So in terms of thinking about how well you're doing and understanding the content, the overall grade is what you'd wanna focus on. Um, the relative grade really only comes into play in the event that you don't finish your course by the end of the term. So if it's a semester class, if you don't finish by the end of the semester, the relative grade is what goes on your report card and you don't have the ability to finish the course beyond that. If it's a year long class, same thing at the end of the year, the relative grade will go on your report card. When you come to the end of the class, whenever it is, um, once you finish the whole course, the relative grade and the overall grade will be the same because there won't be any um, unresolved or open assignments to put, as, to, put, to put as a zero. So in terms of thinking about how you're doing, look at the overall grade, realize that if you don't finish the course, the relative grade is what goes on your report card. But as long as you finish your course, you shouldn't have any problems.